Multiple sclerosis is a disease that can stop you in your tracks. It typically first affects people in their 20s and 30s, but no age is immune. There is, as yet, no cure. When I was first diagnosed with MS, I was shocked. I thought my life was over before it really began. I thought I might be in a wheelchair, I might not be able to walk in five, ten years' time. And then I was calmed down, I contacted the hospital and I spoke to my MS nurse and she advised me to contact Revive. Um, she explained that they'd be able to help, they'd have facilities and resources that would benefit me. At Revive's headquarters in Glasgow's Mary Hill, people affected by MS are offered a warm welcome. They also run six outreach centres in the west of Scotland. How is the day today for you? It's very good. MS so affects people in start. different ways and to varying degrees, and Revive offers therapies that reflect those needs. There can be problems with vision, balance, fatigue, pain, muscle spasms, and much more. Getting a little bit more relaxed. Now slowly I'm going to add a little bit of stretch. Many people experience longer. mobility problems and physiotherapy can help. Forward, up and back, so mobilising the shoulder, take a hold underneath the arm and stretch the arm up, lift the chin and reach towards the The yoga that we do here in the centre has been adapted specifically for people with MS. The key things that we work on in this class are to help um, the people that come along with their strengths and with their flexibility. Sometimes people with MS have to move in different ways and find and explore how they can do tasks in a different way to how they were maybe doing them previously. Well, a person can talk about MS that's affected, although they've got MS. Revive offers counselling services for clients, family members and carers. It's there to help people work through emotional ups and downs that come with the disease. Fatigue we discussed about in the last couple of weeks. There are group meetings on a range of topics, including fatigue management. Staff facilitate the meetings, but clients can set the agenda. These exercises are designed to, to help relax, yeah. and maybe doing them before uh, you eat or drink might, might help. People with MS can have problems with their speech, language, swallowing and cognition. Speech and language therapists can help by offering advice and support on how to manage these difficulties. The number of people diagnosed with MS is growing and Revive services have never been more in demand. No one is turned away, but waiting lists are longer than we would like. I can't recommend or commend Revive more. It's been my saving. If I hadn't had Revive, I don't know what I would have done. So, a little bit of rotation for your shoulder. I just found I could not do without Revive. Revive, I think, is wonderful and gives me hope when I meet other people. To cater for the growing need, Revive has found new premises in the south of Glasgow. Currently, this is an empty office building, but we plan to turn it into a therapy centre that is user-friendly whether you walk in or use a wheelchair. To do this, we need to raise one and a half million pounds we're counting on your support to turn the vision into reality. <laughs>